I still can't believe we escaped the Ashwinders. You may not realize it, but you are the talk of the school since you saved me that day. I wonder how everyone knows about it. I told my mother in the hope that she would be more forgiving of what I have been up to if it came from me. She likely told other professors and... <laughs> news travels quickly. Unfortunately, she might, in fact, have been even less forgiving than I'd hoped. If she knew more about what you've done, I suspect she'd be proud. If she knew any more about what I've done, she would never let me out of her sight again. I'm sorry. Has Officer Singer done anything with the evidence we provided? She has not. Halo is as strong as ever. Someone needs to stop him, whether it is us or Officer Singer. If someone had stopped the monsters like him in Matibililand, my father would be alive today. What exactly happened to your father? It was a beautiful day. My mother had gone to tend to a neighbor who was ill, and so my father and I were galloping in the savannah. Galloping? Your father was also an animagus, I take it. He could become the most majestic giraffe, and he would carry me on his back, my arms around his neck. We were on our way home when we surprised a group of bandits who had come from our village. One of them saw me just as he removed a scarf from his face. He shouted and then aimed his rifle. He didn't want you to identify him. Exactly. In an instant, my father bowed his neck to protect me and was hit. As he fell, my father changed back into his human form. When the bandits saw this, they turned and ran in fear. Magic terrified them, and then he was gone. <sighs> and it was all my fault. Your fault? How so? He died protecting me. If I had been capable of protecting myself, he would still be alive today. My mother and I tried to go on without him, but it became too much for us there. A few years later, we left to come to Scotland. Do you think taking down the Ashwinders will avenge your father's death? No. Vengeance is not what drives me. My father would not want that. He, and my mother, raised me to believe that it is a privilege to be able to fight for those who cannot. I know there is risk involved, but I feel it is worth it. <laughs> I am glad you seem to think so too. What does your mother think about all of this? Well, as you saw, she worries a great deal. She is an excellent seer. But I think it bothers her to this day that she did not see my father's death coming. She misses him. As do I. So I believe on some level she understands my need to seek justice in a small way. But that does not mean that she likes it. Do you think your father would approve of the things we've been doing? Oh my. That is a good question. In theory, yes. Although he would worry as my mother does. But I think he, of all people, would understand my persistence. My father never shied away from a fight for good, no matter how ruthless the foe. And I think he would have enjoyed knowing that I had a compatriot like you. I'm sorry, Natty. I can't imagine what you've been through. Your father sounds exceptional. He was. Truly extraordinary. And thank you for your kind words. We all have our burdens. My father had a saying about that. Yes, I remember. Rain does not fall on one roof alone. Exactly. Soon you and I will put an end to the Ashwinders, beginning with Harlow. And once he is gone, we will turn our attention to Rookwood. We are making progress, and we will succeed. Thank you again for saving me. You deserve all of the praise you have received.
You've made a mistake. That relic is the key to saving Anne. I know it. Meet me outside of Feldcroft as soon as you can. I received your owl. Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. How are they still one step ahead of us? They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. I did see another memory. This time, it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient magic. But I still can't be sure how any of it connects to Ranrock. These keepers are playing games with you. You need to press them for more information. It doesn't work like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete a trial. It's not as easy as you think. They're showing me the memories in a particular order. They... Oh. Either they don't trust you, or you don't care enough about Anne to ask the difficult questions. Of course I care, Sebastian. We've come this far. Don't let your frustration get the better of you. Fine. I'll defer to your keeper friends. For now. But I don't like it. We don't have a choice. Now, shall we see why the triptych led us here? Let's go, quickly, before we're spotted. Keep a close eye out. I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. I wonder why. Raiding, I imagine. This mountain used to safeguard local hamlet valuables. But it's been abandoned ever since... To the cold of the coast. <laughs> Bombarda! No. Defender! Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Expelling off. Nice work. Thestrals overhead. Some consider them a bad omen. Hmm. Not everyone does. I know that. All right. I'm making small talk. I'm not going to trek up this mountain in silence.
I bet the Thestral Nest is close by. Incendio. I'm sorry we can both see Thestrals. It's certainly not something I'd hoped we'd have in common. Kill any of trespass. Wait, we should have some sort of plan. I'm through planning. Thinking. I was thinking about dead goblins. You could have got us killed. But I didn't. Looks like Branrock's loyalists were heading further up the path. Let's keep going. Ramrock's gonna make everyone pay. Anything made from goblin silver belongs to us. Whether it's a sword or a repository, whatever that is. Did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. Someone there. Confirm. Incendio. Only good wizards are dead wizard. Ranrock's got that right, and I'll be most keen to help him achieve his goals in that regard. Listen, you can't stop us. suddenly so cautious listen to me I know you're angry and frustrated but charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made Lord Gok said oh your goblin friend stop it that's enough not all goblins are like Ranrock 
I am not the enemy. We want the same thing, to find answers. I thought we wanted the same thing. We do. Listen to me. Lord Gok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me, or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right, not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Agreed. Gabrioso! So far, so good. Charming. Spiders. How fitting. Bombarda. Fringo. Expelliarmus. Good Fringo. Fringo. Good Fringo. Expelliarmus. Spiders are determined to make a meal of us. I'm sure we taste better than a goblin dinner. leading here. Whatever for. I don't think anyone's been here for ages. Incendio! Confringo! Look at this place. Not really my style. A bit much, if you ask me. Protego! Expelliarmus! Confrigo! Incendio! Incendio! Expelliarmus! Defendo! Confrigo! Incendio! Expelliarmus! Incendio! Incendio. 
Bombarda. So far, so good. Charming. Spiders. How fitting. Bombarda. Arrest over them. Places. Levioso. Confringo. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Incendio. These spiders are determined to make a meal of us. I'm sure we taste better than a goblin dinner. leading here. Whatever for? I don't think anyone's been here for ages. What? Incendio! Confringo! Expelliarmus! In Confringo! Look at this place.
my style. A bit much, if you ask me. Expelling off! Incendium! Can't have been the only challenge. Ah, is finding these chests luck or instinct? We've seen rune symbols like these before. quick enough. Incendium. Defender. 
Angry troll to bring friends together. of things. Debris everywhere. Out of breath after all of those stairs, but the view well worth it. Another barrier. <laughs> this can't be a dead end, must be another floor above us. Good news. This journal entry sounds worrisome. Repairer. 
Revelio. Repairer. Accio. Revelio. Guardian Leviosa, repair her. Can bring her. Uh, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. This place can't have belonged to only Isadora. But the triptych pointed us here. Another rune symbol. I feel as if I should be fluent in runic language by now. This be another area Isadora created. Isadora must have honed her skill with ancient magic here. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. The final canvas piece to the triptych. We've done it. Isadora should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. So do I. Perhaps completing the triptych will shed more light on all of this. believe the journey this triptych took us on. This is it. Well, don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. Huh. Another pensive. This is what we've been chasing.
I wonder. What is it? Let's find out. I cannot bring my brother back, father, but I can give you peace. Please, have a seat. Isadora! <laughs> We are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Isadora. his pain. Thank you. That worked. It did indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. I need something much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this unnerves them. Oh, everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. But someone will be. <gasps> she took away the pain. I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. I, I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felgroff, the destroyed painting. It was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. Yes. Yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. But I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain, it's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic, one that should be wielded with great care, if at all. If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. Please, talk to the Keepers. If not for me, then, then for Anne.
Why did the keepers want to keep Isadora quiet? Why destroy her portrait? Randrock's drills in a mine along the shore. I intend to destroy it. I'm tired of trying to reason with him. You're welcome to join me, but if I don't see you there, I will reach out when I return. I have something to give you. Lord Gott's getting himself into more danger than he realizes. I'd better find him. <laughs> 